Can Open Architect is a software application designed to allow quick and easy creation of object dictionaries. It can export documentation, electronic data sheets, and source code for CanOpen nodes. In this video, we will look at the documentation export feature of CanOpen Architect Professional. CanOpen and CanOpen FD projects start with the object dictionary, where the data and configuration of a node is laid out. From there, source code is exported to a CanOpen stack and EDS files are exported for sharing with third parties. CanOpen Architect Professional also has the ability to export documentation for use in product manuals or internal reports. By tying all of the export functionality into the same application, consistency between firmware, third party files and documentation is guaranteed. Exporting is easy. Select an EDS and click on the word export function. This creates a document that can be further edited. The document starts with general information about the EDS, such as who created it and when. Next is the product and commissioning information. This is followed by an overview of the PDOs, first the communication parameters, and then the mapping entries. The following section has an overview of the object dictionary. The rest of the document has a detailed list of each entry and sub-entry. The default word table style is a simple grid, which is a bit dull, and there are two options. Either manually edit a document and change the style for each table to the one you want, or set the export style in the preferences. Here we've set it to medium grid 1 accent 3, one of the built-in styles. The export functionality can also make use of templates. To demonstrate, we have a template prepared in advance with some corporate styling. This template was created in Word. In the template, we can add custom styles for headings and tables. In this case, we have a table style called EMSA Table 1. As you can see, with very little effort, we now have a complete report with corporate styling that can be shared with others. Each entry and sub-entry has a comments field. And here we can add a description of what each entry does and how it is used. Comments entered are then included in the export. I hope this video has given you a good overview of how useful documentation export can be for CanOpen and CanOpenFD projects and how much time it can save. Thank you for watching.